Welcome to my channel, I'm Gary Wiriawan and welcome to another everyday photography vlog where I try to, you know, capture some photographs in everyday modern life. You can check out the other vlogs right here, but basically in this video, I'm trying to, you know, capture Spaddy Field and also I'm eating lunch in the restaurant, so I want to try to capture a little bit of the restaurant as well using my camera and lenses, try to make them as look, uh, to look as good as I can. So yeah, that's the whole point of this vlog. In terms of camera gear today, I'm carrying two cameras with me. The GX850 Panasonic Lumix Micro Four Touch camera, as well as the Leica M8.2 uh, camera as well. And I'm using a few lenses today. I'm using the Panasonic Lumix 14mm f2.5 as well as the 7 Artisan 35mm f2 for the Leica camera. So yeah, let's try to take some pictures. Alright, so because it's raining, I want to try to stay indoor and just try to you know, find some spots in this restaurant that I think are worthy for photographs, make a nice, you know, kind of a vibe and kind of look that will turn into a nice photograph in the end. So for our first photo shoot of the day, I was thinking of trying to photograph this sitting uh, area right there with the umbrella thingy uh, outside. So I'm going to try to employ the elements of this building to make it into a frame within the frame kind of composition. So for the first composition, I want to try to use the Leica M8.2 with the 7 Artisan 35mm f2. Oh, it's a little bit dirty. Let me clean it. Alright, I think it's clean now. Alright, nice. With the IR filter, because as we already know from my previous vlogs, this camera is really sensitive to IR light. So yeah, let's try to capture something. Uh, I want to try to focus first. You cannot really see uh, how I focus because it's using the range finder. There's no live view with this camera. So yeah, please give me a moment to focus and I will share the photo with you later on after I finish taking the pictures. Right. Focusing is a little bit tricky because it's using the range finder focus. I have to really be patient and just try to nail the focus as best as I can. Let me focus on the chair because I think that's the uh, that's giving me the most kind of contrast in the viewfinder. So I'm setting the camera to auto ISO and aperture priority. I'm currently at F2 so let's try to capture the image. Let me see if it's in focus or not. I have to check whether it's in focus or not because, you know, the focusing can be a little bit tricky. Yeah, I think it's focused just nice. Right, I'm going to try to capture some more pictures from this uh, kind of composition. I'm going to try horizontal composition first. Right, very simple. A little bit too high. I'm going to try to, you know, lower the camera a little bit. See, nice. All right, now let's try vertical. I'm not changing the focus. Trying my best to, you know, keep the composition overall the same. Let me duck a little bit. You know, with the Leica, there's no tilting LCD screen, that kind of stuff. This is very manual, so you have to use the viewfinder. There's a little bit of a drawback, but it's fine. Let me try one more time. Something like this. All right, I think it look good. Yep. All right, so the rain stopped currently, so I can take a few more pictures. I walked a little bit outside of the restaurant and I found this paddy field. Uh, it doesn't have a uh, focal point, uh, you know, something that will anchor the eyes of the viewer. So I'm trying to kind of find something, but maybe I will just try to photograph it as it is right now. So I'm using the Leica M8.2, aperture priority f5.6. So I'm going to try to kind of hyper focus, you know, using the hyperfocal distance. So on the lens, you can see right there, there are some markings of the meters and also the aperture. I want to try to set it to right about there. So at f5.6, hopefully everything from five meters all the way to infinity will be in focus. So yeah, no need to really focus uh, precisely. Just try to do a ball part kind of focusing. Let's try to capture the image. Going to duck, crouch a little bit, so, and wait for the car to pass back. I think by doing this, I can 
get a nicer composition you know what I'm trying to adjust the focus a little bit more I want to try to focus into the uh, grass on the front right there <clears throat> and try to capture pictures all right let's try to capture the image all right looks nice let's try to capture a few more you know what I think that brown house right there could be a nice anchor point for the eyes so I'm going to focus on that house instead let's try all right nailing the focus yep looks kind of nice if I crouch then I can kind of get a more balanced kind of proportion of the foreground and the midground the paddy field and the house and the sky looks kind of nice yeah I'm taking a few pictures but I'm not sharing everything as you, as you can see right here yeah it makes for a nice photograph that house really adds into the overall image yeah I'm glad I found that house let's try to take a couple more pictures I'm only going to share to you the one that I think uh, is the best so yep there are plenty of people passing by maybe I want to try to capture one of them passing by right now so I switch camera to the GX850 and currently I have the 14 millimeter lens with it and I want to try to get close to capture the paddy field that brown house right there together in one frame using a wider angle lens so I'm going to set the camera to aperture priority and maybe let's try f4 or f5.6 let's try f4 first <clears throat> and what I want to do is to try to include this grass area down below try to make that house as sort of the focal point of the image so let's try to capture it I'm focusing on that building right there something like this now we're going to try to crouch a little bit and adjust how much foreground and background you know the proportion between all these things let's try one more time all right I hope you can see what I'm doing in the camera using the GX850 without having to use the rangefinder focusing system yeah it's kind of nice it's kind of convenient and it's really quick definitely you can see what I'm doing in the camera and also it has this tilting screen really helps for lower angle composition something like this yep really nice All right let's try to capture a few more vertical composition I'm going to raise the camera a little bit more something like this yeah the rain stopped thankfully so now it's kind of nice and dry I can do more uh, I can take more pictures yeah the GX850 is performing really well for this kind of thing all right so I'm trying to capture that house one more time with the Leica camera so what I have in mind is that I want to crouch down and try to use this you know grass thingy right here as sort of a foreground of interest to help frame the brown house with a little bit of the paddy field as well with the Leica there's no viewfinder once again you cannot really tilt the uh, you know screen as well so you have to look at the uh, a viewfinder with your eye so that's a little bit of a drawback but you know makes you do all kinds of things just to get a nice photo and that's what I really love about this camera it forces you to really become immersed in the process of taking pictures so yeah let's try to take the picture setting as f5.6 aperture priority everything else is just automatic I'm focusing on that brown building right there trying to make sure that I have a little bit of the uh, a grass thingy right here on the frame as well as the sky and a little bit of the plants on the left on and also on the right all right let's take the picture let me check the focus first I hope that it looks nice yep kind of look nice let me take a few more pictures all right making sure focus is all right let's take the picture all right yep I want to try to 
aim it a little bit lower on the frame you know the ideal spot would be me in the middle of the road but that's dangerous so I don't want to do that you know I have to make do with this situation And that wraps up today's video. So that is all for today's video. I hope that today's video has been interesting, entertaining, useful, and inspiring for you. So yeah, a little bit of challenge with the Leica. Uh, definitely is the focal length, 35 millimeter on it, turns into 46 millimeter, a little bit tight. I'm not really a 50 millimeter kind of guy. I prefer something a little bit wider. But yeah, I can find some compositions today using that lens and I think they turn out pretty good and also the focusing is really slow because you have to manual focus using the viewfinder there's no live view with that camera but it's also nice in the if you think about it because it makes you slow down and enjoy photography more so yeah those are all the challenges today and i hope that i was able to try to make uh, the best situation as I can. So yeah, please let me know in the comment down below which one is your favorite picture. Also, don't forget to support my channel by liking this video, sharing this video, and subscribing to my channel. Thank you and see you on the next video. Goodbye.